Okay, so today I thought I'd do like a talk through get ready with me video because we're going out for like iftar and yeah, so I'm just gonna put a little makeup on, not too much, you know, whatever. It's my day off, so um, I don't like to put a ton on when I'm not working. So I just put my moisturizer on and it's the Lotus Youth Preserve Face Cream by Fresh with Super 7 Complex, I don't know, whatever. I got this in gratis, so that's what it looks like. It smells so good, it smells so good. I don't even know what it smells like. It smells just really refreshing. Oops. Extremely moisturizing, which is awesome. I can't figure out what skin type I am anymore. I think I'm a definitely a combination. I used to be really dry. Or at least in the summer, I get kind of oily. It's weird. So I've been trying different foundations because I, I mean, I like to glow, but I don't like to be super oily, <laughs> you know? So um, I exfoliate every night. That's why I feel like I have pretty good skin because it's always, you know exfoliate it off or whatever I always have new skin cells but yeah um, it's definitely um, drying out my skin or, or it's like making my skin think that it needs to produce more oil, oil I don't know but yeah so that's that um I think I'm just gonna do a little eyeshadow not really sure I'm just winging it so here we go I'm gonna prime my eyelids with this um, benefit stay don't stray um, stuff. It's like an eyeshadow primer. I just got it in gratis, so I've been like trying to feel it out. I don't know if I like it or not. Yeah. It's very different from the Urban Decay Primer Potion because it actually looks like you're putting concealer on your eyelids. Does that make sense? Well, it's good for if you have like veiny eyelids. I guess I have somewhat veiny eyelids, but it dries really fast, so you have to work quickly with it. So after that, I'm just gonna do my eyebrows. Everyone always asks me what I use for my eyebrows, and I feel like I say it a lot, but um, here we go. I'm gonna say it again. It's the Anastasia Brow Wiz. It's amazing. It's like the most amazing thing. I've tried everything for eyebrows, like powders, pencils. It's between this and, um, I don't know if you guys where you live, if you have Essence, it's like a super cheap brand. They started selling it in Walgreens right now. I know it's an Ulta. That's what I wanted to use. I have the brow pencil in blonde and it's amazing too, but this is like super awesome if you're like just free handing. The Essence one is really amazing if you're just like, um, filling it in. But yeah. Because I like to kind of draw shapes. I like to go square, circle, you know, round or whatever. So I'm just going to do round today, I think. Well, it pretty much has the shape. Just fill it I'm going to fill it in a little bit more. For that, I'm going to use Blonde Brow Powder. It came in this kit originally, the Anastasia um, Beverly Hills Beauty Express for brows and eyes. Oops. Oh, snap. <clears throat> what it comes with is all these stencils, which I don't use, but I think they're really cool to have. Um, and then uh, it comes with a wax. And then a brow powder duo. I got this in gratis too. So this is um, brunette. And then this is the blonde one. Oh my god, I'm dropping everything. Okay, that's the blonde one. Compared to the brunette one, it's super dark. I like the blonde one better because my hair is lighter. So I'm just going to fill it in a little bit. Oh, Lulu! Where is 
fishing. The booga, what did you bring me? Give her the flower, Lila. Oh my gosh, she gave me particles of a flower. Yes. <laughs> what am I supposed to do with those? Oh, thank you! Good day, I love you, Mama. After that, um, I'm gonna use my Dirty Blonde Fluid Line Brow Gel Cream. Oh, that's a lot. Um, by MAC and Blonde, and I'm just gonna do the ends. And then um, I got this in the sale bin at Sephora, which is awesome. And then I got my discount off of it, so it was like it came out to be something like three dollars or something. But it's, an, it's such an amazing eyeshadow. It's um, outrageous Prisma Chrome. It had like beige, something like that. But I'm just gonna put that all over the lid. a little shimmer. Nothing cray. I'm just gonna use this bronzer from the Sleek um, Sleek Contouring and Blush Palette in Medium. Just to define my crease. eyeliner I've been using lately everybody's like been going crazy about um first I do the gel liner actually no I lied some days I do the gel liner but um so this is the star of the show lately it's the Stila stay all day waterproof liquid eyeliner it's just got the most perfect point ever so yeah just gonna do a little wing Alright, so I just did a wing. Um, I decided to do it off camera because I have to get so close to the mirror sometimes. And, you know, the wing takes forever, so I decided to do that part off camera. So, whatever, you know what I'm saying? Okay, so then um, I just added a little more bronzer in the crease. Um, after that, I'm gonna do some mascara, your um, show iconic overcurl. That's what the brush looks like. And that's done. So for my um, waterline, I use um, just any regular eyeliner pencil, and then I dip it into the Maybelline High Studio Gel Liner, and that's how I line my waterline. <laughs> Hi Layla. Hey. Hey, look, it's Layla. Hey. <laughs> so then after I lined my waterline, I'm just gonna wipe up. Okay. Now I'm just gonna do a little yeah. foundation, not a lot because Austin doesn't like a lot of foundation, right, little Austin? So, um, I totally love the red long color stay. And I use the shade buff, but obviously that's wider than I am. So, yeah. But I totally used my last one up completely. So this is a brand new one, as you can see. I'm trying to open it. Oh my gosh, I can smell that from all the way over here. Jeez, Layla. 
Ready to go eat some fishies? Plus it's the best. Fishies? Thank you. Let's go eat some fishies. So I'm just gonna put a little bit on a hole. Okay, let's put a new diaper. Just to cancel out my redness. Huh? Diaper? On this brush from Fedona Lace. Fishies. Is that what you're Fishies? Then I'm gonna blend it out with the beauty blender. I'm gonna go now. Okay, I'm almost done. What time is it? Time to go. Okay. Give me a sec. After that, I'm just gonna take my Maybelline um, Natural Beige Pressed Powder and Maybelline Fit Me Foundation, whatever. Um, this is the shade 220. I'm just gonna take my e.l.f. Kabuki brush and pack that on. It's gonna give me more color into the face, if you can see the difference. I love this powder foundation. After I put powder foundation on, I'm just going to put a little blush and a little bronzer, and then I think I'll be good to go. Let's see. Look at that. The blush I'm going to use is Satellite of Love by NARS. I think this because I got it um, in gratis. I don't really show up with anything. So bronzer, I'm just going to use my MAC Matte Blush in Harmony, um, looks like this, and Sephora brush, and just contour just a bit. I wanted to wear lashes, but I don't think I have time. And just a little bottom mascara. Top two. <laughs> this is just the e.l.f. Mineral Infused Mascara. It's amazing. So my eyeliner doesn't run. Okay, I'm coming! Just a little bit of that, what I put on my lid. That's good. Um, I'm gonna bring this with me, the Maybelline Line Stiletto, just to touch up the top. That's how I get it really black as I layer my mascara. And then, um, for lips, I'll probably just use my Ferris Nude. It's the number 800, it's by L'Oreal. It looks like that, it's just a really pretty nude. If Asif yells my name one more time, I'm going. Ah. Probably put a little pink lip gloss over the top. Like, I just use this Gemma Good Lip Gloss in, um, 09. Looks like that. And then that's it. I'm just gonna spray my face with, um, Hope, Philosophy Hope's it Springs Eternal, just to, like, unpowder it. It's not a setting spray, it's more like a refreshing spray. If I dry, I'm gonna do my scarf now. Alright, so this is the makeup. Um, if you guys liked it, thumbs up this video. I gotta go because Asif's about to kill me. I hear footsteps! I'm coming! What? Are you mad? I'm coming. Okay, I'm coming. Alright, so I gotta go. Bye guys!
thumbs up the video if you like. He rarely helps me, but he always comes over and says something. You took my car, Seth, and then you said I could take your car to the bank. I didn't recognize you in that kind of in that car. You're driving that car. And me. Base coming out of there. <laughs> Hi guys. Okay, so we're at um, Austin's brother's restaurant. His name's Ari. Um, it's called. What's the name of the restaurant? Street Kitchen. It's an Asian bistro restaurant. It's in like the Denver Tech Center area. So if you live in Colorado, you should definitely come check it out. But he's gonna make us the best sushi in the whole wide world. So here we go. Put the rice on the nori. It's gonna look like like that normally. So we got the rice on. That's the seaweed stuff. Is it always imitation crab? Um, some people do full crab sticks. Uh -huh. It's not very common. It, uh, is it like really? Here, people like the imitation better. They do. The head sushi chef, yes. right? Head sushi chef. What's that? That is seared tuna. Oh. Oh, so that's how it's perfect, huh? Comes out. Awesome, thank you. So we're just about to break fast. Layla, what are you eating? What is she eating? Crab Rangoon. Crab Rangoon, this is Asa's beautiful mother. She's like my backbone for everything. She is Layla's number one babysitter. Mmm, delicious. And we're just eating at Ari's restaurant, which is Asa's brother. And... Ari! Ari! <laughs> Did you hear her call you? And he, what I just filmed is him making the, what is that? The cal What do you call that roll? He's really, really shy. Ari. What do you call that roll? Uh, SK Sushi Roll. K Sushi Roll. SK Sushi Roll. So that stands for Street Kitchen Hemp, which is where we are. Yeah. So <laughs> we're going to eat now. All right. Okay, so we got our main course, which is like Lao Ming. Lao Ming. I got the veggie one. Did you get, what did you get? Shrimp? I got Lao Ming with shrimp, yeah. Oh, Lao Ming with shrimp. Oh my gosh. What, what, what was right here again? You want this? No, it's crab crab the crab rangoons were like killer. Oh my god. Like, pasta. Okay, sit down. It, on your it was so good. I'm going to give you some um, pasta. Layla. Wait, what's that over there? Veggie, veggie egg roll. Veggie egg roll. Uh, so, do you see the resemblance? No, it's too spicy. Um, so we're gonna eat now. Looks so good. Can you say that? Yummy. What are you eating, Ari? Uh, pineapple. 